it feels so good to finally be back home again back on oahu as much as i love traveling honestly there's just no place like home and it's starting to feel like summer again which is my favorite time of year so i'm feeling good this morning i woke up the weather looked like this and i was like are there things that i need to do yes but they can wait because I haven't been to the beach in a while. I also got home from my trip to Australia and before that I was in LA. So I feel like it's been a while since I've been settled at home for a bit and I'm gonna be home for the month of May, which I'm so happy about. Anyway, welcome to the home vlog. The water feels so good, it feels so good. Oh. It's only 9.45 right now, so we have the whole day ahead, which I'm really excited about. Very, very lovely morning. I feel like it's been a while since I've spent quality one-on-one -on -one time with myself, and that's something I really love and need to do, so I'm glad I did that. That was really nice. Hello, buds! <gasps> it's been a while. Mm, you're so cozy. It has truly been a while since I think you guys have seen Coda last, but I thought it'd be nice to stop by my parents' house this afternoon. I brought them lunch. They're not home yet, so it's just Coda and me. I feel like if you're on the newer side to my channel or you started following me after I moved out, you probably wouldn't be super familiar, but this is our family dog. He's a little Brock Francais. He's so sweet. He has a really cute smile. He's two and a half. He likes to chase birds. And that's kind of it. Oh, also, the best part, I am allergic to dogs. So I'm gonna break out in hives in about five minutes. But until then, I will enjoy. And you know what? The thing is, I'll still enjoy after because, oh my God, it's starting. Anyway, this is where I used to live. It's so pretty. I miss the backyard. I miss having a backyard. Oh, he's on the prowl for the birds that are in our backyard. I think one of the things I'm most excited for to have my own house one day, not an apartment, but like a home, is one, a backyard, and two, being able to have Coda over. That's why you never see Coda in my apartment because it's in my lease agreement that I'm not allowed to have dogs or plants, so that's why you'll see none of that. The plants that I do have are fake. But anyway, I'm going to hang out here for a little bit. I love visiting, and I also brought my parents Tim Tams to try. This was by far the thing that I loved most about Australia. I'm just kidding, kind of, I don't know. I mean, honestly, this is really good, and I have a whole pack now, so I wanted to give my parents some to try because it is so, so good. I'm getting real itchy now. Really itchy. Bless you. Do you want to go on a walk? <laughs> okay. Okay. I just got home and I also just started my period, which means the rest of this day is gonna be void because I'm going to be couch ridden. So I got myself a boba. I have my heating pad. I'm gonna be here till tomorrow. Hello, hello. It is another day after the whole cramp fiasco yesterday, the rest of the day kind of just went downhill. So we're gonna redeem it with today. I still wanna have a good day, even though I'm not feeling my best. That is not the energy I want. So I'm not gonna think about it. I'm wearing an OG little sun glow shirt. I'm obsessed. This one is in a size extra, extra large, I think. Yes, we go up to 3XL. So snag yourself a cozy little shirt. I live in sun glow shirts because they're just so soft and they're made out of 100% organic cotton. Quite literally to the brim. One thing I miss a lot about Australia is how good 
Well, everything just tasted better there. I don't know what it is. I think everything is just so fresh and just tasted like something magical was put in it. But I had the best coffee of my life there. I had the best chai of my life there. And I also had the best matcha of my life, which says a lot because I've, I've tried a lot in my day. And you know, I'm just gonna be chasing that for the rest of my life. But one thing I did miss was like my homemade coffees, but damn, I'm gonna be chasing that forever, so. I will probably be dressing in basic clothing till I die. This camera is so aggressively massive, but here's my outfit. Very simple, nothing that impressive, but everything's from Aritzia. Not a shock. Before I get going with my day here, I wanted to do a little unboxing because I accumulated. I will link these down below, but I've had a fixation with like beer shirts. And then this one I thought was super cute. It's just this little record shirt. So I got these in an extra large. Oh, I'm so excited about this. This is from You Swim. I'm actually working with them, or I did work with them on the podcast. I'll put my code on the screen if you want some money off, but I've been a fan of You Swim for so long. And they sent over this adorable one piece, which I'm so excited to wear. I've been a fan of them, like I said, for a while. I have quite a few colors. I'm feeling extra excited about this package. I have been obsessed with Frida McFadden. I read two of her books literally in 48 hours. So I looked up some of her other hit books. I got Never Lie, The Locked Door, and The Inmate. So these are gonna be added to the TBR. Ooh, Supergoop sent something, which is so cool. I am such a fan of Supergoop. Are you serious? <gasps> all of their glow screens. Are we shocked at a package from Aritzia? Unfortunately, no. Wow, would you look at that? More basics. I don't know how these are gonna fit. My fly has been down this entire time and none of you told me. Ooh, these are cute. Wow, I actually really like these. And I think, yeah, it's the same thing in black. I don't know if I would have left the house today because I don't really have plans for anything as of right now. So I'm going to do some work at a coffee shop. I also just know that when I try to do work from home, I get really easily distracted. So I'm going to be ahead of the game here. Okay, it's a few hours later. Got lots done. I'm going to... I'm gonna pop into Target real quick. <laughs> that was boring. One thing about me, and you guys already know this, but... Oh my God. The Sriracha squirted in my eye. Oh! Oh! That was wild. I should have known better. Every time I open this, I'm so overstimulated. Good morning. Oh, you look pretty. You have lip balm on. Uh, I have lip gloss on. My boyfriend's coming home. nice little corner at the beach here. So I've been swimming in my little spot. The water's so nice. Look at that. Good morning. 
actually have fun, I go, I have really fun plans right now. Something I've never done before. I'm gonna make strawberry matcha, which I've been seeing people do online. And I don't know why I always thought that that was like a cafe thing and I'd never be able to do it myself, but I just placed out all the ingredients and I'm going to attempt to make an at home strawberry matcha. <laughs> I've got all the things. We've got the matcha, the strawberry milk cream, and then cute little cup with some ice. You guys actually sold out this cup. This was a sun glow cup. So let me know if you want us to restock it because this is literally the cutest cup ever. It's perfect for morning drinks. I don't know which one to do first. Now we're gonna take the strawberry. Yes. As someone who's a big fan of strawberry milk already, this is pretty revolutionary. out here always always in the clock <laughs> well tell them what you did for me which i was like what shout yourself out doordash <laughs> doordash for ava <clears throat> <clears throat> this man brought me starbucks yeah. starbucks <laughs> I'll give you a kiss, but I don't want to run the makeup. <laughs> get into it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, get into it. We're back with Lala again, doing another shoot. I'm in Lala's studio. We just had so much fun. We did a podcast shoot, shot some sun glow things, and then just did like a fun little basic outfit. But she recently got a studio. So if you're looking to shoot some campaigns, I will put her Instagram on the screen. Definitely check her out. We did a podcast episode together a while ago, but the space is so cute. This little corner I'm obsessed with. It's this little retro vintage little record corner. <sighs> Micah's here. <laughs> got the studio, my queen Lala. Can I show them? Yeah. I start showing them Go anyway. <laughs> this is her. <laughs> no, literally her house tour. How cute. I feel like we don't really have anything like this in Hawaii, so it's really cool to have like a creative space like this. And then there's also this little area to do hair and makeup. That's Come a wrap. This is Lala. You already know her. <laughs> but yay, done for the day. Just got home from the shoot. I'm about to record a podcast episode. I took a little two week break from the podcast and I really miss it. I'm excited to get back into it. So there's a new episode that's going live today. And speaking of things that are going live today, I wanted to tell you about the new Sun Glow shirt that we're launching today. It's literally just one item that we're launching. This cute little Sun Glow logo tee. And on the back it says under the sun is where I belong. I love this graphic. I love our cute little shirts. You can make it into an outfit, throw it over a little beach fit, and we have sizes extra small, two, three XL. So it runs very true to size. Sometimes I'll size up one or two sizes if I want it to fit a little bit bigger on me, but I will link this down below because they are launching today. They're made out of 100% organic cotton. I'm so excited about these. If you remember, we had a sticker that literally was this design and a lot of you were saying it would be super cute as a shirt. So we've listened. New shirts are available now. I'm so excited. This is gonna be a very limited launch. So get your hands on it while you can. And now we're gonna get to recording. It's 
been a while. I really am excited to hop on the mic. I miss talking to you all so much. If you don't know, I have a podcast. It's called On My Mind and it's the best community. You all are amazing and I'm very excited to get to recording this episode. Yay! I've officially been home for about a week and a half now. I've been trying to get back into the routines that I was in before I left because I had built really good routines for myself, which felt so good. I was feeling amazing. And the last week I've kind of just been pretty relaxed with myself, just like getting my shit back together, which honestly was needed and resting of course, but I'm ready to get back after it. So I'm gonna do a little workout, get my body moving. It's another really, really beautiful day outside. So I wanted to do something outdoors. I feel like when I do something outside within the first few hours of waking up, I just have such a good day, always. I'm kind of doing the most today because usually when I go on a walk or a run, I just like stay where I live, but I also live in the city and I kind of just wanted to walk in a neighborhood because it's definitely a different vibe. Did I drive out of my way to do this? Yes. And I'll do it again. I've just spotted this little library. <laughs> How cute is that? This is the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Maybe I'll bring books that I've read here one day and leave them. That's so cute. I will not be taking any because my TBR has over 50 books and I haven't read a new book in a while. That's a different issue I need to address. I've been off my reading game. I was on it, then I was off it, but I'm gonna get back. Okay, now I'm gonna try and run. <laughs> the beginning of a run is always so awkward. Like, do I just start like galloping? I feel so good and I feel especially good knowing that I was gonna skip this today and I didn't, so I'm proud of myself. I feel like the more I keep promises to myself, the more confidence I have and I just feel better. So I'm glad I did that. Um, I think I'm gonna end this vlog here on a very sweaty and out of breath note. If you stayed till this point in the video, comment down below the strawberry emoji so that I know who stayed. I hope you enjoyed this home vlog. So many more to come. I'm so excited for summer vlogs. Get ready for that. Have a lovely day.